Hello everybody, Terry Robson here. Just wanted to give you an update and also share something with you that um, a gentleman called Martin Page shared with uh, with me uh, the day before we handed the petition into NICE, making the volume app available in England and Wales. He wrote a poem limerick and it was about us visiting NICE and uh, the situation, I thought it was really apt and had a real um, seriousness about it, but also uh, made me giggle a little bit. So I just hope I do it justice. And uh, Martin, forgive me if you don't feel like I do, but I'll try my best. So here we go. We know of some loonies called nice who think they know all about price. Of the drugs and of treatment, we are not in agreement and think they should go take a hike. So Terry will visit their lair and make the daft sods aware that she ain't going to move until they get in the groove and give Terry's mum proper care. For the drugs that are used just over the wall should be used both for both one and all. So come on now, nice, thaw your hearts of ice and make sure you make the right call. And if you will not listen to sense, then maybe you ought to go hence and find something new that maybe you can actually do instead of just counting the pence. So... I hope you agree with me that it was a clever limerick poem um, and actually gives the situation um, a lot of justice. We do not know when NICE will be making their final decision and guidance. And that is a problem because lung cancer sufferers at stage four do not have much time and time is so precious. So the sooner they make the decision, the better. And when we're talking about how many people are diagnosed with lung cancer and how poorly funded and researched lung cancer is. For instance, 28,000 people die alone in the UK from lung cancer. 41,000 people are diagnosed in the UK alone. And it's the biggest cancer killer across the world. So... I want to say to each and one, each and every one of you that I am so grateful of your continued support for this campaign and only us standing shoulder to shoulder can we make change happen. I'm still hopeful and I'm hopeful every day because of the encouragement that I receive from all of you out there. Take care.